Since the late 1980s, the Wyoming Game and Fish Department has helped monitor and manage trumpeter swans included in the Rocky Mountain population. Recovery has included releasing captive reared cygnets and the occasional yearling, along with habitat improvement projects. Back in July, the Wyoming Game and Fish released four trumpeter swans at Eden Reservoir in the Big Sandy region of Sweetwater County. Biologists hope the birds can establish new nesting territories and expand their numbers. Trumpeter swans are North America's largest waterfowl and are considered a species of greatest conservation need in Wyoming due to their small population size and specialized wetland habitat requirements. At one time, as many as 100,000 trumpeter swans were estimated across North America, but by the early 20th century, approximately 75 trumpeter swans were thought to exist in the lower 48 states, and extinction was a concern. Trumpeter swan populations are now coming back in North America with approximately 63,000 birds. The Rocky Mountain population has just over 1,000 swans with 200 in Wyoming. Simply releasing trumpeter swans back to their previous habitats is no guarantee of success. Migration traditions have been lost in many areas. Swans won't always explore locations without swans already existing there. And their habitat needs are specific, including shallow wetlands with an irregular shoreline, abundant and elevated nest sites, low levels of human disturbance, and other factors. Game and Fish has collaborated with various organizations, landowners, and individuals to develop shallow water wetland ponds for additional summer habitat and forage. From 1992 through 2004, the Upper Green River Expansion Area Project expanded and improved wetlands and translocated more than 100 cygnets, and a majority of Wyoming's trumpeter swans are here. Game and Fish continues to explore new wetlands for possible flock expansion, with one being the Big Sandy area. The Game and Fish hopes to release swans in this area each July for the next 10 years. The swans are captive reared at the Wyoming Wetland Society's Jackson Area facility. Monitoring will assess the success of the initiatives and gain insights into the swans' behavior, movement patterns, breeding habits, and nest productivity. This is Ray Hageman with the Wyoming Game and Fish Department.